Good morning. I've got some 40 calorie coconut milk here. Just going to put a little bit into my mug because I can't remember how many ounces it holds, but I'm going to make some Alto Intenso this morning. And yesterday I was reading this box for a different reason. I was reading it to see uh, what kind of notes it says it has. And I saw something that somehow or another I've never seen before. I mean, I, I read these things, but you know how it is when you're paying attention to certain things, you might miss other things. So this is what I read. This blend offers you the robusta richness with the same in-cup caffeine levels as our existing Virtuo coffees. This is it. Thanks to a blend of regular and decaffeinated roast and ground coffee. I knew, I mean, I remember that even though this is a 14 ounce cup, that it doesn't have more caffeine than a regular um, eight ounce cup. But I get, I don't know, I didn't really think about it. And then I, yesterday I was reading, it's got decaf in there too. By the way, I'll read the rest of the description of Alto Intenso, why we love it. We blend three unique coffees to give Alto Intenso its steadfast, strong presence. A washed Robusta from Guatemala is the pillar of strength in this Nespresso Intenso. Its thick crema and lingering bitterness meet the sweet, malty notes of Costa Rican Arabica. So, you know, how about that? Um, oh, by the way, it's an intensity of seven out of 11. And um, on there's a little, another little place that lists contents. And under contents, it says, 10 capsules of a blend of regular and decaffeinated roast ground coffee. You know, so um, I just didn't happen to notice that. Not that it makes a difference, but you know, sometimes what you know, information that you have, uh, can make a difference in how you feel about something. Well, look at this. I haven't even put the capsule in. Well, that just shows when I'm talking, sometimes my, uh, well, I'm not paying attention to that. I'm paying attention to this. See, what you're paying attention to, that's what you notice. So, you know, I was just going to say something this morning. Um, it's a little bit not coffee related, but basically, because I've been sick for a few days, I haven't listened to the news, watched news, looked at the news on the internet or anything like that. And you know what? I'm still here. I'm getting better. The world has not come to an end. Um, and I'm happy. Instead of possibly being worried about things that I hear on the news and stuff. So, Sometimes what you know, the information that you have, can affect how you feel about something, can't it? Now, um, I guess if I had been thinking about, oh, well, this, this stuff is half decaf. Uh, well, you know what? All this time that I've been drinking it, I didn't know that. And actually, I like the Nespresso decaf options, and I use them. But... I don't know, it might have affected how I felt about this, but instead, I didn't know about it and I've just been enjoying it. And you know what? I think that's why most of us really, really like our Nespresso, because it's it gives us several moments of relaxation and enjoyment. You know, some people are in the habit of having a cup of coffee while they watch the news or read a newspaper or something like that. 
you know what? Have a cup of Nespresso coffee and just enjoy it. You know, you don't have to be doing or thinking about anything. Just enjoy it. And sometimes it gives us adventure. Maybe I shouldn't have put that milk in there. Oh my gosh. Mm. Too late. <laughs> kind of looks like a mug of beer, doesn't it? Oh my goodness. Well, now I know this cup probably holds Oh, 16 ounces and the Alto Intenso makes 14 ounces, but that doesn't count the Crema. And oh golly, okay, so I guess I, <laughs> I still want to mix in that milk that's sitting at the bottom. You can see it coming up there. Well, Sometimes we have unexpected things happen, but you know what? So this should be my worst problem today, right? <laughs> I hope that you have a really good day, and I hope that you don't mix up a pleasurable experience with an experience that can make you upset because I don't know about you, but today I'm not going to worry about the things that I have no control over. I am going to enjoy the things that I can. Mm. Now I'll do a little bit of cleaning up before I drink some more of my coffee. Have a great day, y'all. <laughs>